Hi everyone, just a short one today, unboxing of my new Kawaii NV5S hybrid piano. Now, I wanted to get normal piano for a while now. I usually practice on my complete S88 keyboard. It's in my studio and it's okay, it's fine. But one, I wanted something that feels like a real piano. And also I want to have a instrument in the living room and I wanted to have an instrument outside of my studio because when I practice on the complete 88 it feels like work I'm in a place of my work I haven't got much room in my living room so I was hesitant for a while but in the end I said screw it I'm gonna get a piano now I'm gonna spare you the details how I arrived at this particular model I'm gonna make a review in a few months when I had time with the instrument and I'll explain the process there in this video I want to show you what you get when you order an instrument from Kawaii the NV5S model NV5S is a hybrid piano what it means is that it has an acoustic box a smaller than the uh, upright acoustic piano, which played part in my decision. Inside you have real hammers and real dampers. The difference is that instead of strings, we'll have sensors. So the piano plays and feels like an acoustic, but the sound is generated digitally. So what you get is obviously the piano is looking modern, is looking slick, it's smaller than an acoustic, which that's why I got it, because it fits in my living room. 88 keys. Beautiful, they feel like a real acoustic. Then underneath, of course, we've got our three pedals, so sustain, your damper pedals, etc. And then down there, we'll have all our sockets as well as the volume. So we can put which is great if you want to practice, if you've got neighbors, etc. And then, of course, we've got our input for headphones, so we can practice on headphones as well, as well as others, USB, MIDI, line in and out, and things like that, and then the power. On top of the piano, we have the speaker, and one of the speakers, there are several inside the piano, made by Onkyo, which is a Japanese company that make these high-end speakers. And at the back of the piano, there is a soundboard with six of these speakers. So again, this is to imitate how the real acoustic piano would sound. And of course, the best part is the touch screen. We can select our sounds. There are four main pianos on there, grand pianos and upright, but there are plenty other sounds. You've got your organs, you've got your strings, you can mix and match, and then you've got all the settings that you can also adjust. So settings of the instrument itself, setting of the reverbs, uh, even settings of the, like, the feel of the keys. We also have some learning options. So there are some songs that allow you to learn. Recording options, so you can record a few songs on the internal memory, but also we can use USB stick and then record your playing on the USB, which I'll definitely be trying out so I'm gonna spend a few weeks with the piano. Of course, it needs to settle. It's quite cold, it's February, so you can feel the keys are cold. It's gonna be a few days before the keys start to feel proper. And then, yeah, we'll record review where I go in depth of all the options and what I think of the instrument. So thanks for watching and thanks to Bonners for delivering the piano and for their customer service.